this is MC signing on and welcome to Random Cat Gaming. I decided to do a pretty early stream today because there's no way in the world I'm going to be able to stream later tonight. But I also decided that I didn't feel like playing Diablo or any of my other standard games. So I went through my Steam library and picked the most random game I could find that would download within about 10 minutes versus an hour. And I came across this game. Wumpa? Or Wumpo? Either way, it has round shapes, it's an indie game, that's about all I know, it's programmed by some people in the Netherlands, I think, but either way, it looks cute, let's play it. I have no clue what I'm doing. Uh, play game as intended, use your boss fights, let's do normal, because I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, let's see what we got here. Well, we got the Wum House entrance. Oh. Yeah, I'm here. I'm... I'm here again. <laughs> so what do you need? Yeah, who is this? Dot, 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 dot. This is Carlo! From the service desk downstairs. Did I just end up back at work again? I think I've just ended up back at work again. Hey, don't play dumb with me. You just called me 20 seconds ago. Uh... No, I didn't. <laughs> oh, I could have sworn. Wait. Hey, don't try mocking me. You did call me. Calm down, dude. I, I, I just woke up from a nap, I think. I, I think. Dot, 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 dot. Okay, so what do you need? I want some food. Nothing. Uh, I don't think I need anything. I think I'm good. You called me. The call the source says to tell me you need nothing. What room number is this? Oh, it's you. Are you sure you did want to order some ice cream? Like you did the last 32,248 times you called me? Uh, you know, ice cream would be nice. I I've had a long day of work, so some ice cream would be nice. So, sir, ice cream. Okay, well, too bad, pal. Just like the last time we spoke, the transporting system doesn't work anymore. So you're going to have to come downstairs to get your ice cream. Well, I can do that. I am a little blob, though, so I might not want to. I'm not sure when you left your room for the last time, you know, since my last outburst. <laughs> so I'm going to say this. You can move with the A and D and jump with the W, all right? Oh, and you can duck or dive underwater with S. Yeah, that was weird. See you downstairs. All right, so I now know how to move. Uh, look at me, I've got little leggies. Oh my god, this is so cute. Look at the little leggies. I got little leggies. So I'm gonna go this way. Oh, I got a little happy. What? Oh, this is a pizza box. I'm jumping in the pizza. Pizza, pizza, pizza. It's over this way. Oh, it's a balcony. Oh, I can't jump to my death. Well, I guess I really didn't want to. I'm so happy! Happy, 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 happy. Mud Rustler! So is that mud in here? I got an achievement Mud Rustler. Eh. So is that mud? Okay, I, I guess I should move on. I'm starting to sort of get this... Ah, uh, jeez. Damon is meowing. My poor cat. I wish someone would talk to me. I can do that, little guy. I would love to talk to you. I really want some... I really want a friend. Should I hit the L key? E? I, I hit Q and Q looked like it did something. N. 
Enter space. C X E E uh, uh Do I click on you? No. Well, I guess that really didn't help. Sorry, dude. I really wanted to talk to you, but I can't. Well, I'm in a bit of a puzzle, I suppose. I want to go down, down to where the ice cream is. Ice cream? I want ice cream. Do I need to push something? I can hop on top of this. Oh. Oh! I can get on these. Though I don't know what the reason for that is. Can I get on top of the door, maybe? Take this plant. Okay. I'm really trying, dude. I want to talk with you. Space. Troll. R T T for talk. L for lecture, B, B, N. Did I just fall asleep? One, two, three, four? No, this is not Diablo. Okay. Is it four? Four maybe? Nope. I want to talk to you, but I don't know how. I'm trying. I can't get into this room. Oh, I can I can whistle. Maybe that's what he means by talk to. Let me talk. I I click and I can. Oh, oh! I'm an idiot. All I have to do is click on him. Ah. Uh. Okay. I haven't seen your face in a while. To which floor would you like to go? Floor one, please. I want ice cream. Okay. Down we go. It's good elevator music. I might have overheard your conversations over on the phone. And I just want to say that Carlo, the womb from the service desk, might sound incredibly mean, but he's actually a great womb. So I'm a womb. Every Since everyone is leaving, Carlo is taking over so many more tasks. Without him, the womb house simply won't survive. Gee, this sounds like my job right now. <laughs> oh, okay. That sounds reasonable. I'm glad you understand. I feel bad for him sometimes. I do too. I actually do as well. Anything else I can talk? To which floor would you like to go? Never mind. I'm good. Okay. I'm going to bet that this is the... Can I open the door? Knock, knock. Knock, knock, knock. This can't go that way yet. We will go this way. I lost the lift. You can jump against the button to call the lift. Next! I forgot how to do a double jump. You jump twice. Oh! Does the transporting system work again? No, it's still unavailable. You must be Carlos. Hi, Carlos. How's it going? I'd like to talk with you. Oh, hey. So you want your ice cream, huh? Yes, I do. Yes, please. Ice cream, please. Okay. But promise me one thing. All right. I still haven't forgotten the last time you ate ice cream. And I'm pretty sure you haven't forgotten my outburst. But to be fair, you messed up the entire hallway. 
Well... Hee 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 hee. So please, take the ice cream back to your room and eat it there. Without leaking the whole thing throughout the womb house. Okay, I think I can do that. Eh, no problem. I can do that. I'm serious. Don't leave a mess this time. Eat the ice cream inside your room. No worry, I got this, I think. As I am a noob and have no clue how to play this game. Okay, here goes nothing. I has ice cream. Keep your I'll keep my eye on you. Alright. Oh no! I'm getting ice cream everywhere! I really want to try not to do this. Oh god, I'm he told me to take it back to my room and and eat it there. Which floor would you go to? Uh, four, please, as quickly as possible before the service guy finds out about it. I can't help but thinking that new cooks are creating a monster down there. <laughs> you're probably correct. I've heard some strange noises coming from there. Yeah, you're probably correct. This is probably where the amnesia monsters came from. Alright, thank you, man. You cool. Alright, uh, quickly get back. The ice cream is melting. I am getting back to my room, and I'm going to... Oh, no. Ah! I told you not to spill the ice cream throughout the hallway. I didn't! For what's... For what's... Could you make my life a little easier? I can't... I'm sorry, man. That's it. I've had enough. Guards! Throw this womb from the balcony. Oh, that's what I was trying to do before. The womb house has no... Longer has room for this kind of behavior. I'm sorry, but I, like, I, 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 oh no. I'm being thrown from the balcony. Oh no. That's a long drop. Ow. Oh. That fatty might have some nice items. You're probably right. Sweet! I'll never have to be bored again! It's a television. I don't even have to care. I don't even care that nobody visits my store anymore. Oh well. Time to run! So, I had a TV inside me. That's why I was so fat. Well, I guess I'm now smaller. If that was how easy it was to lose weight, it was just to remove a TV from your system. Um... They should let people know about that. Hey, let's go. Oh, I love the music. It's so cheerful. Oh, I'm swimming. Dear friends, I have moved to a different location. Some bird won't stop making annoying noises. A nail sweater? So, if I can get rid of the bird, I can get into this house, probably. Or I can just hop onto his building and go down the chimney. Can I eat this? Oh, I can hide in the basket. Let's go this way. What's this? What's this? Oh, it's a safe spot. How lovely. Ooh, I found some coins. Oh, come on, little guy. There we go. Oh, I can get out that way. I'm dumb. Let me swim. Dude, Bert. We gotta figure out a way to get rid of the bird. Hey, there's a chef up there. Hey! Ahoy there! How'd you end up, uh, there, wum? You got thrown out by Carlo, the service desk wum. Don't worry, I can open the door for you. Thank you! One sec. Ah! What is this? Sorry. The door's blocked by something. I can't get inside either. No 
okay. It's okay. Well, what do we do? Hmm. I guess we can always ask Elzewater. He lives somewhere here. But not too long ago, he moved to a different location because the bird was getting on his nerves. Well, I found the bird. <clears throat> it just keeps making the same noise over and over again. And whenever Elzewater went out, the bird followed him. I guess Elzewater moved to a location where the bird can't follow him. That makes sense. Hey, have you found Elswater yet? No. Oh. Well. I know he moved because of that noisy bird, right? He must have moved to a place where the bird cannot follow him. Alright. So, he moved somewhere where the bird cannot follow him. He must have moved underwater. Because birds can't swim. Which is why there's a little thing down here. Yep. Makes perfect sense. Hi! A visitor? Finally! I didn't expect you it would take you take so long before our one found my new house. Hmm. I don't think we've met you before. Let me introduce myself. I am the Owlswetter. And I know everything. How do I get home? Uh, you want to get back to the one house, you say? Yes. I will tell you how to do that. But only after you sat down for a nice story. Okay, I can do that. I did that so many times with Deckard Cade. It's crazy. Come on. You don't want to miss this opportunity miss an opportunity to gain wisdom, do you? Nope. Let's go inside and to start the projector. This is this is a meeting, isn't it? This is a born meeting. Do you have any film strips? Uh no. Well, to tell the story the right way, I need a film strip. Hmm. I guess I can give you a film strip for free. That'd be lovely. Thank you. Congratulations on your first film strip. Let's open your inventory by pressing tab. Use A and D to navigate through. Settings. Aha. First steps. Finally click on the film strip to wear it. Done. Well, you're wearing your film strip now. Start playing your film strip simply by simply... You simply need to walk close to the projector and click on it. Go ahead. Oh, that projector. First steps. Oh my, this film strip tells us about the very early years of the existence of the world. The, f the first steps on this planet were set by four different races. As you can see, our people are one of them. Wums are the most intelligent kind, but also the most lacking in abilities. They are known well, you know. We pretty much rule the planet now. Even without any special skills, the Wums managed to become the most powerful race by building and wearing all sorts of equipment. And as you already guessed, we also been the most fashionable race since day one. Here's a slide of the Busser. Busser? Busser. Bussers are known for their ability to carry lots of water. They are also known for being the most friendly race. After the Faulkner Roars, they became gardeners of the Wums. Now that's more like it. Look, here's a slide of the Splunker Harders. <laughs> Splunkers. Splunkagar. Okay. Splunkagars are not the smartest race, but they certainly are the m one of the most practical ones. They are known for their ability to harvest Splunk. Splunk is a very powerful material, and the most of the womb houses was built within it. And at the last here is the side of the Funkiners. Beh, I can't stand their faces. I can't really say their names either. Funkiners were known for their ability to throw up rocks. Disgusting. They were very aggressive and they didn't want to share the world with the rest of the other races. That explains why the Falconer Wars started. They threw rocks at us. Great! Uh, but after the war, there wasn't a single Funkiner left. Exactly. No mercy for these ugly fellows. Oh, nice. How nice. Here's a picture of all of them lined up. 
Wums, blusters, spunkinokiners, and funkiners. That's a nice piece of history, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Oh, right. You wanted to get out of that place and go back to the room in the Wum House. Well, the truth is, it could be very dangerous. You see, normally you wouldn't be able to just walk in and out of this place through the kitchen, but in and out of this place in the kitchen, but for some reason that door is locked and I can hear some strange noises coming from the kitchen. Anyway, you're going to have to find the underground tunnel to get back to the Wump House. But finding the tunnel could be very, really difficult. Of course, it never easy. Also, there seems to be a group of strange looking creatures higher up in the trees. They seem kind of friendly though, I just don't know what to think of them. Just in case they are planning to harm you, I will give you this weapon to defend yourself. Good, I now can beat things. Here you go. Equipping it is easy. Well, it's almost exactly like equipping the film strip. Only this time, you will open the blue icon in your inventory. Press tab and open your inventory. Blue icon. Gum, gun, gun. Easy, right? Equip every item you acquire on your journey. The item I gave you is a gum gum gun. Holding the left mouse button will make you continuously shoot gum gum balls towards your cursor. So if anything is in your path is unfriendly, give the gun in a gum gum shower. Oh, and one more thing. Sometimes you'll find a yellow gum gum blocks. So you can easily destroy them with your gum gum gun. I used them to seal off my previous house, but I feel free to destroy them. Now it's time for you to go back to the womb house. Good luck! Thanks, I suppose. Let's go this way. Did I just kill myself? what that's about. Uh, how do we get out of here? Jump to the blubber and swim the way up. Yeah, I know it's not very practical, but I just couldn't stand that noisy bird any longer. This is the only way to hide from it without getting followed. We'll hit it again. Da -da -da -da. Items. I need a match. Need a match? Let me see. Thank you! Here you go. I don't know why I needed a match, but, you know. Swimmy, swim, 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 swim. Can't shoot the bird. Well, let me go. Go away, you stupid bird. Well. Can I light it with it? <laughs> does not like me. Uh, dude, your bird is, uh, not being helpful. Can I shoot him with gum gum?
I would love to, you know, just shoot the bird to death. sign might be explaining what happened to him. So, can you read the sign? Yes. What does the sign say? Uh, Alswater moved because of you? Well, that's not completely unexpected. Our relationship is very complicated. I really tried to be his friend, but I can't help myself from yelling, Wait! Every few seconds. He really hates ways. But after a while, I started enjoying that. Hey, what about you? What's your name? My name is, uh... Scallywag? I love that name. Anyway, it looks like you're gonna stick with you for a while now, Scallywag. So I might as well tell you what I'm useful for. Whee! I spent a lot of time around Alzwater, so you know I know many things now, too. You can equip me just like any other item in the game. Whenever I see something and I have some information about it, I'll spread my wings. If you click on me, then I'll start talking. Woohoo! I love information. Let's get out of this dump. I wonder what happens if I take him down to Al's water. <laughs> hey, look! Hello again. Do you have a question about something? Yes, I've got. I found your bird. Okay. Hey! No! What have you done? Hey! Please take that bird away from me. I will, I will. You have any information about this thing? Guess not. Oh well. Now that we've noticed Oswater, we can, uh. Looks like Alswater was cooking something before he moved out. Maybe we can light the stove with a match. Maybe Alswater still uses them. That makes perfect sense. Of course, now it's raining. It's making bubbles. Oh no. Oh no. At least there's no fall damage. Darn, I need to jump quicker. Oh, darn, there's a brick wall there, so I can't do that yet. Alright, let's... Float away. All right. Let's go ahead and save what we got. And let's whip our gum gum thing. Well, I want to get that film scroll, but I can't do that yet. Let's go this way. What's here? Boinky, boinky. Temple ruins. 
Let's see what our little birdie friend has to say about them. Oh no, this don't look good. This look like boss fight. Wonder if I could just shoot like go back this way. Oh no! Gum gum! Save me, gum gum! Ow! 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 Healthies! I need healthies! He's almost dead. Healthies! And I got some kind of thingy. We'll look at that in a moment. Let's take a look at it now, actually. What is this? A bucket! Used for carrying water. Can we... I have a bucket on my head. I got a bucket on my head. Hey, you haven't found Al's water yet. Yeah, I did. Great. Well, how do we get back? Uh, underground tunnel. Underground tunnel. That sounds scary. I think I'm just gonna stay here until someone opens the doors. Good luck to you, though. Thanks, I suppose. I'm gonna be a blah 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 blah. I got a bucket on my head. I got a bucket on my head. Doop, doop. Doop. I would like to use this to get some water. For whatever reason I need water for, but... Well, I guess we will go through the old ruins and... See what this is. Or did I just completely... Oh, no, I didn't. There we go. Ah! No, come back! I'm, I'm here to... Hey! I, I didn't mean to scare ya. Yeah, let me put my gun away and just get my talking bird. Guess not. Yay, platforming! My favorite thing in the world to do, because I don't know anything. Alright, let's grab our gun gun, because I'm sensing we're going to run into some trub trubs. Now, how do I get down there? There's another save point over there. Oh, I see why there was a save point. Thorny thorns. That's authority thorns. Ah, 
okay, let's give this a go. why there's a safe boy here. Ow, ow, and I died. Okay, so you can die in this game. Just not from falling to your death. Oh, oh, I figured out how to get up here. Yay! I found a scroll. Let's go take a back to what she's face. Save. We still gotta figure out that. Going down to go watch the film strip. Whee. Hello, I have a new film strip. The Frankener Wars. Ah, classic film strip about the Falconer Wars. The moment that set our four races set the four the moment our four races set foot on the world, the Falconers decided that they wanted to rule it. Immediately a war started, of course. The tough times arrived, especially for the ones. They had no way to defend themselves from the Falconer attacks, whereas the Bussesers could spray the Falconers away, and the Spunkenarkers could spit. Spunkin' our rocks. The Wombs were forced to use their intelligence if they wanted to survive. After a while, the Wombs figured out a special technique that would lead them to victory against the Falconers. A Wom called a Bird Smolder discovered the brute force behind the combination of the Spunkin' and Bruise Water. When the spunk gets in contact with the bruise water, the spunk will absorb the bruise water and increase in size tremendously. The spunkers would spit the spunk rocks while the bussiters would spray the bussiter water on them. With the power of this combination and strategy, the wums, the three races, bundled their powers and pushed the falconers down into a sinkhole. And so the war ended. So you basically sent them all underground. The Wums celebrated their victory by building the Wum House. The Busters went to live right next to them in the garden. The Spunkaters went on their own way, feeling destined to build a theme park. Ah, so they went and decided to start Roller Coaster Tycoon. Perfect. In my mind, what a theme park it was. I wish I could go live in Wonder Splink. The film strip always... Is always a good time. Thank you for bringing it to me. I lost mine ages ago. I will give you something in return. And a reward is wisdom. You get wisdom! You, s you are much wiser now you've seen this film strip. Feels great, doesn't it? Yay! I've got an experience. I now got extra health. Which I'll probably need every little bit of it because I really stink at platforming games. All right, let's see if we can figure out the... Well, if I keep doing this... Okay, I clearly need some way to get over there. Alright, since we've now gained our wisdom. Hello? 
I would like to talk with you. Uh, come on. Oh, almost made it. I think I need to get to that other one at the top. No! Silly trees. There was like a wormy doodad up there. Ah. It's like I hit the double jump at the wrong. There we go. Whee! Okay. Oh crap! Oh crap! stable well bugger I can't get up there it's like just out of reach Ah, it looks like I'm gonna have to go from the top. Come on. Bouncy, bouncy. Bounce, bounce. Yeah. Come on. Come on, wub. Ah, crap, 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 crap. Ah. I just need to, like, take my time. I just need to take my time. As probably the creator's like, I did not intend this to be this difficult. But clearly the creator did not expect me to be playing this. <sighs> Alright. Wait. There's like a little strip thing here. Can I? Birdie! Tell me! What is this thing? Or not tell me anything. Got up there once. All right, we got up there again. So it looks like we gotta get to the thingy up at the top. Okay, that does fall. All right, we're gonna do a run and jump here. We're gonna do a run and. Oh dear, that's dark. And I know that there's vines there. All right, we got this. No! Dude, you could maybe give me like a little bit more height. Okay. Boing boing, boing boing, boing boing, boing boing, boing boing, boing. I wonder if maybe I can use my gum gum gun and do something to that bloke down there. Local currency! No, I don't want the bucket. I want my gum gum gun.
I feel like there's a much easier way to do this. I am just too dumb to figure it out. Can you let me in, please? There must be an easier way to do this. There must be an easier way to do this. Come on. So we can't break those. It should not be this hard! This game is rated like three! Ages three! Okay, maybe there's another way of dealing with this as soon as I break out of the cycle of bubbles. Passage. So the only place underground that I know of is Ad Wessel's place. So let's go there instead of trying to work out these other things which I so far haven't been able to work out. I have no idea what this is doing. Bird! Help me! Yes! How do I freaking do this stuff? Yes. Well, first thing you should know is that, well, you can change any time using the mouse wheel. Oh, perfect. Once you have many items, you might want to start using hotkeys to equip them. You can easily do that by going into your inventory and hovering over the item. Well, yeah. Okay. Oh, well, that is nice information to know. What else do we have here? Ah, all right. Yes, I, 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 I have many questions. Actually, yes, you should definitely know more about it. Da, 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 da. Is there anything else you need to tell me about? Okay, something I've already figured out. Thank you! I would love another match. Maybe I can burn this thing. Well, it's giving me a health bar for some reason here. Ow, that's why. So I hit that, I get hurt. A total loss here, folks. I don't know where to go. Whoops. Back into the hoop. Let's 
let's go down. So I can't go. Ah. Wait, is that a passageway? No, it just looks like it. What am I supposed to do? Am I using the water bucket wrong? It clearly gave me a water bucket for some reason. Besides from being fashionable. Oh no. There's more of those spiky things. Still don't see any underground passage. And this is as far over as I can go, and then the rest of it's just go boingy boingy all over the place. Freaking for three year olds. I can't even find the secret passage. Can I break the door down? Dude, do 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 do. I am so confused. I am so lost. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Am I missing a, like something? This happens to me like in every single game too. I get somewhere and then it's like, nope, nope, nope. You get stuck because you can't do platforming. Can I use my bucket now, maybe? Maybe I'll get struck by lightning and that will give me superpowers or something. The vines are gone. Oh, wait, never mind. The vines are gone. Ah! Well, I got the other film strip. Well, I guess let's go down this way. So, this is on top of the, uh, That thing. Let's go watch the other film strip because that's about all I can do. Maybe Professor Dude will give me a uh, give me a hand here and like tell me like, oh, here's like a flying whirly do thing to help you get across all these passages because you're a Nimcom perp. Blesser's Garden! Ah, this used to be the second part of the film strip, along with the giant asteroid temple, the Biolomes came! 
They had unexpected fluke that look completely out of this world. They have arms like Frankeners, but even bigger. And they only have, only have two strong legs to walk on. They are very capable of climbing and collecting things, but somehow their minds seem to be extremely primitive. The worst thing about the biolooms is they have a heavy strange instinct to defend, defeat rocks. As you know, busters are very fond of carving figures in rocks. It wasn't long before they had destroyed all their best works. As an attempt to calm them down, we try to show them the fun part of statues by creating one of them for them. A statue of the figure they seem to like so much they called it the Sleeping Vertical Rock. Instead of destroying the statue, the biome started worshipping it, hoping it would lead them so to something. So he started a cult for them. Great. Even though we calmed down the biomes, the last few busters left with it a couple of days. Even without the biomes destroying their statues, they still took all the food they could find. They destroyed spectacular flowers and trees that we once created. We accepted the fate of the garden and left. That's sad. They grew such a nice garden. If they were still here, I bet they would visit me every day. Very interesting. Here's an Aurora board. Gold! Alright. Well, I'm gonna have to call it a part here because I have no clue what I'm doing and... I am totally lost at what I'm supposed to be doing. And clearly he just gave me a bunch of gold, which I still can't... I haven't found a shopkeep anywhere or any of such things, so I don't know. This is a really cute game. I just wish there's a little bit more instruction with it. Just a little bit more, because I still don't know what I'm doing. Even with Birdie Dude not telling me what I'm doing. Don't know. Anyway, this has been Random Cat Gaming. This has been... Whoopo? And I am MZ, signing off.